Uh, well, here I, I decided to go and say a little bit more. Probably don't need to, but I was curious, so I graphed f double. This is f double prime. So I graphed it on Desmos, and as you can see, it is always negative, and it it's it's undefined. Um, this is one. Well, here's one. So it's undefined at one or less. It's only defined above one. So everything we might expect, it's always negative. And what that means is this is this is f prime. Because f double prime is always negative, it means the slope of f prime is always negative. And if the slope of f prime is always negative, that means the slope of the original function is always going from, um, is always becoming less positive. So if we go to the, because this is always negative, I mean, this, the slope of this is always negative, um, that means the slope of the original function is always becoming less positive. So here's the original function, f of x. The slope is very positive right here, and it's still positive. Of course, it equals 0 here. We already determined that. But you can see the point is it's always becoming less positive or more negative, and that's what gives it the concave shape.